uh, hi uh, today we are going to see uh, how we can uh, expose so based web service in a rest format in a apg platform so we have a backend api which is a soap api but uh, we wanted to expose that as a rest api so but we don't want to create you know one more rest web service in my backend system okay so in order to expose so based api as a rest based so we can do that in a apg platform so here we are going to see how we can do that so for that you know i'll just uh, open my apg uh, platform i'm opening apg platform with my login so i already logged in so that's why it's coming and i'll go to the api proxy so how i'm going to do is click proxy so which will create a new proxy and here it's a what i'm going to do i'm going to expose so based web service in a rest format okay so i'll just click this one so we are going to make that as a restful okay so we need a so based url so i'll take that url from the um, online so i'll just go to the soap ui website which has a calculator whistle i'll uh, use that or the calculator endpoint we have so we using that you know we will expose that as a rest okay so this is the whistle path uh, where you know we have a calculator api which is soap based api which has a uh, four operation add divide multiply and subtract so what i'm going to do is i'll just take the whistle path from here and copy it and i'll just put it here okay so okay i'll just validate it okay so i have this name already so i'll just change this to calculator uh, rest okay so what we are going to do is uh, whatever the soap based api so this is a soap based api which is my backend api which i'm going to expose it as a rest okay so calculator rest demo so in this right uh, i'll just click next and i'm going to expose this my apg uh, platform i'm going to expose it via apg platform so if you see here rest to soap soap to rest okay so in this one what we are going to do is our soap api we are going to expose it as a rest okay so i'll just select this one otherwise you know if you wanted to expose only as a pass through then you can do as a pass through which means you will call your apg platform via also soap based uh, api only but in this example we are going to call via rest okay so i'll select this option and all the operation we want so this one also it's a get method only because uh, uh, it works that way only in the backend api so it's a get method and i'll click next and i'll ex i'll uh, deploy uh, this into my secured http environment okay and also finally right so i want to deploy this one only in the test environment so here it's giving a summarize uh, summarize detail for what we have done so we have uh, created a so calculator rest demo with this backend api okay so we have selected a proxy type as rest to soap soap to rest and we are going to deploy it in the apg platform i'm just selected i've selected only the test so it's going to deploy only in the test environment so now it's currently creating a proxy and also it's deploying into your test environment of apg platform okay it's deployed so i'll just copy this endpoint and uh, as it's a rest right so i can use any uh, rest client to test this api i'll just go to the proxy list i'll just show you how that is created okay because we applied some soap right so this is a calculator rest demo i'll just open the proxy so it's opening now once it's opened right i'll go to the develop tab so if we go to the develop tab see it's had a lot of policies here because you know uh, it has to receive your request as a rest and then you know it has to convert your soap based api so soap based api normally you know it lab a envelope headers and other parameters right so those kind of policy it's adding okay so it's basically you know add with this policy it's converting your rest based request to soap based format okay and finally it's invoking your proxy target endpoint which is you know uh, your target endpoint is nothing but uh, okay so this target endpoint nothing but your uh, dna online uh, website only okay so this is a soap based api but uh, how we are receiving this request to our uh, apg platform we are receiving in a rest format okay i already copied our uh, proxy url from this overview okay so this is uh, our uh, url i'll copy this one so that you know i'll use postman so i am going to use postman i'll click the new window so i'll just use this is my endpoint okay uh, as it is a rest right so it's a get method and uh, this api if you see this uh, so based web service it's a, having a field called int a int b okay i'll just try to pass that value int a equal to 11 ampersand int b equal to 
20 okay i'll just run and see what is happening okay so this is the rest right so in the rest we are calling that and then what is saying fault name unknown rest race fault okay 404 resource not found so it's saying it's not available okay so i'll just click because we have many method right so i'll just click add and i'll see okay so because in our endpoint we have many flows so if you see here it's calculated now 20 plus 11 equal to 31 so the result also came in the rest format but actual backend api how it is giving is it's giving a response in a this kind of xml format so your apg platform it's converting that in a rest format and it's giving in a rest response so why we are passing this ad it's because uh, when we add uh, when we create a proxy right i'll just go to the proxy and we create a proxy in our apg if you go to the develop tab it is adding a lot of pre flows okay so uh, this is a policy data i'll minimize it so it's adding a add pre flow okay so in this add pre flow only it is adding all the required headers for soap what is required and uh, how it needs to be mapped to the actual soap operation inputs those kind of things it's happening here so that is why you know we have to call the appropriate method add divide all this stuff okay so this is the uh, addition so even i'll just share, run it with another input 200 plus 11 211 so you are able to see okay so if i wanted to you know call another method so i wanted to call subtract right so tap subtract 11 minus 200 then the value will be in minus right so minus 189 so in this way you can call different methods which are available in your soap api via rest so what we have done is we have uh, downloaded the whistle basically you know we have uh, took the whistle url from the online uh, and we expose that via our apg platform but how we are exposing it we are not exposing it via as a pass through we are exposing it as a rest to soap soap to rest right so those kind of conversion type we are using it and using that we expose the soap based backend api as a rest api so there is no specific development required for your you know rest based development we just created simple you know uh, wizard we just created you know uh, rest based api and what are the backend api still it is there but it's you know the functionality how we are achieving we need to pass the relevant parameters in the we need to pass the relevant parameters in the input so that you know the pg platform receives the request in the rest based format and finally you know when it calls it uh, calls the soap based api with the soap based parameter and uh, that backend api which will give the response in uh, soap based response and finally apg platform will con convert the soap based response to rest based response and finally it gives the results in the rest based response okay so you are able to see the response also in the rest so similarly so here if you see the uh, url we are passing the method name as well so we have four methods so internally you know it's created four different endpoints uh, oh, it's a one endpoint but you know it's a uh, created a four different url for our four different method so in this way we can expose so based api also in a rest based api in apg platform yeah thank you for watching and uh, if you want more videos in uh, apg so what you can do is you can go to youtube and i have a channel for technical videos which is tech lightning i'll just quickly open and show you tech lightning which is my channel name so once you search with the channel name so this is the channel name tech lightning so we have a lot of uh, existing apg videos and uh, different playlist available so if you go to inside the channel and if you are looking only for the apg video then you have a playlist for apg so this api management using apg cloud so you have a uh, apg videos and if you are looking for a uh, videos for integration then enterprise integration uh, play series is there and if you have a specific video you are looking for uh, mulesoft then you have a playlist for those as well okay so if you like the video you like it and uh, comment it and also if you like it you share it with your friends as well and also subscribe this tech lightning channel for more videos thank you for watching thank you bye bye